If you've been wanting to make your own perfect YouTube thumbnail, then this video is made perfectly just for you. I got a comment in my comment section that the particular person told me he or she, I don't know if it is masculine or feminine, so he or she wants to learn how to make YouTube thumbnail. So that is why I am doing this particular video for this special person. Before you can get your own perfect YouTube thumbnail, the first thing you will be doing is for you to download the app. And the app you are going to be using to design this YouTube thumbnail is Canva app. So first of all, you go to Google and then download this app. Alright, so if you have downloaded this app right now, then you can continue watching this video. So after you've downloaded your Canva app, you can go to your Play Store or your Palm Play or whatever. Yes, or go to Google and then download this app. Alright guys, so once you are done downloading this app, the next thing is for you to click on this Canva app and then let's start. Let's get started. But hold on guys, this app, it is free and it is not free. What I'm trying to say when I mean it is not free is that you have to turn on your data. You must have done data subscription. So you have to turn on your data before we proceed. Yes. So now that you've turned on your data, you're just going to click on this Canva app and then it's going to load and take you to this place. You're going to see a lot of things. You could edit your YouTube banner, your um, YouTube thumbnail and wallpaper and so many things. But what we want to do in this video is you designing a YouTube thumbnail. So we are going to click on the YouTube thumbnail and it's going to load and show all these things you are seeing and we are just going to keep on scrolling till we see the perfect thumbnail we want to use for this video. I will click this particular type of template for the design we want to use right now. Once you've clicked on that particular template you want to use, it's going to load and now that it has loaded already, I'm just going to change the text format to the one I want. So I will click on this how to become a. So I'll click on it and impute my own text to it. So I'm just going to type how to edit a YouTube. That is what I'm going to type right now. Now that I am done with this first test, then I'll click on this second one to also edit that template. Then I'm going to type thumbnail on it. The next thing to do is for me to attach my picture and before that, I am going to add on to my app to remove the background of the particular picture I want to use because I want it to align with this thumbnail. This app takes me straight to my gallery and I'm just going to select the particular one I want to use and it is just going to remove the background for me ASAP. I will click on the download to download the image. Just in case you don't want to use that particular picture, I'm also going to select another picture that I'm going to be using for this particular thumbnail. I will also remove the background of that picture. In case you are wondering what type of app you want to use to remove that your background, CapCut app also do that same features. You can also remove it with CapCut. So let's add on to this video. I will select the template picture. So it's going to take me straight to my gallery and I'm just going to select the particular one I want to use. I'm just going to click on download and then it takes me straight to the pictures there and I select this one I want to use and then it loads and automatically appear in this picture template. I'm just going to select crop and crop this picture and I'm going to also drag the picture this way because I want it to be in a very perfect way and you can as well enlarge it by dragging those four sides of this line then drag it out. Right now I noticed that my hand is not showing in this picture so I'm just going to click on this right side 
I'm going to enlarge it like I'm going to drag it forward like this so it's going to show my hand and I'm just going to also adjust the other side because it seems the other shoulder has been cut so I'm just going to drag it also out for this process you need to take your time when dragging these things so you won't make mistakes so you just have to adjust it well to your taste now that I am done with this whole process I'm just going to scroll and click on adjust so this adjust here you click on it and this is the time to change the game of this thumbnail so I'm going to adjust the brightness of this picture and also the contrast the saturation and the shadow while adjusting this video with these features just make sure you are not overdoing things just use a less figure saturations and for the others you can as well go to the filters and also add filters of your choice but while clicking on these filters i noticed the effect was too much so i decided not to use any filter at all but if you love the filter and you feel it is good for your own thumbnail you can use it the next thing I'll be doing is to remove these patches designed by my left and also the one by my right and on top because I do not need that design on this thumbnail. The next thing to do is to either click on the save icon or the download icon. Anyone is fine. So I'll click on the download icon and then download this thumbnail. Once you've clicked on this download, do not click on any other thing except download. There's no need to click on anything. Then your thumbnail is getting started to download. And once your design is prepared, it will export directly to your gallery. You can as well go back whenever you forget to add something. So now I'm going to copy that out to edit YouTube test. I'll copy it and then write A to Z below the thumbnail. You can write anything you want to write but I want to put A to Z. You can as well adjust it to the position where you want it to be. Then once I'm done with this process, I'm just going to click on download up here. Canva already automatically put this picture on PNG so you do not have to change it except you don't want your thumbnail in PNG. So this is all about how to you know, edit this youtube thumbnail please try it and let me know in the comment section you guys should ignore this top sheen on my face and um, the sun is reflecting like and everything so it is reflecting from the way so this is what you are seeing reflecting on my face right now <laughs> all right guys so if you are watching this video series moments please kindly use this moment to give this video a thumbs up by liking it and also subscribe to my youtube channel Turn on your post notification icon to get notified whenever I upload a new video. Thank you guys. If today is your first time, please do not make it your last time. And to my returning subscribers, you guys, you guys are welcome. Now that I have explained how to make your own YouTube thumbnail, I hope you'll be able to do your own by yourself. And let me know in the comment section if you were able to make your perfect YouTube thumbnail. Thank you guys and see you in my next video. Bye guys.